In Isaiah 60 verse 1. He said arise. He said arise. He said arise. He said and shine. Someone say, I have a responsibility in my shining. I have a responsibility in my shining. Do you know? Do you know that the Lord said, Arise and shine. You have a work to do. You have a work to do. Nobody will fix up your beer. You do that in your bedroom. Right? Yes, sir. When your hair is bushy, you take yourself to where they cut hair. Mm-hmm. If you are a lady, you take yourself to where they make them. If you don't want to even make their back, you can take it off. Are you hearing me? Uh-huh. Is somebody following me? Yes, sir. You will take yourself to a place in your, in your house where they pour water on the body. And you will find a sponge that will not peel you but clean you. And you will scrub that body. And when you come out of your house, somebody look at you and say, Now nah you be this. Ato. Take a good look at yourself and see how you are looking good. I tell you, if you have not been to this church, wherever you are watching, if you have not been to this church, start coming. Because Ato. even me, you know fine. Enter this church. I give you only one month. So, oh my Ato. God. The oil is working. Mm-hmm. It's working. Working. There is transformation that starts from within and radiates on the outside. Uh-huh. And nobody becomes somebody. somebody. Jesus Christ. Am I talking to somebody? Yes, it is a preparation. No? It's a mindset. No? It's an understanding. An understanding. Something you have decided to do with your life. Can I shock you? There are those who are forced to fail. Write it down. There are those who are forced to fail. And there are those who choose to fail. There are those who are forced to fail. And there are those who do what? Choose to fail. But a little, small, minute group of all the populace on the earth has choose to succeed. And that is why those who are succeeding on earth, they are less than 10% of the whole population of human race. Are you aware? That those who have made it and that are constantly making it today, they are just less than 10%. What happened to the rest? Many are forced to fail and many have chosen to fail. In 2022, your choice will be one thing to shine. Your choice will be one thing to shine. You will do so. You will do so, not only your appearance, you will do so in your content. Write it down. You will do so what in your content, what a man carries is what makes him that he cannot hide in the multitude. What a man carries on the inside, even when you put him among men, his gifting stances out. The Bible says, A man's gift maketh room for him. Now, hear this among your father's children, there's a fool and there's a wise person. Make your choice. Among your father, your mother's children, there is the rich and there's the poor. Make your choice. Where you place yourself, that's where you will be. <clears throat> now the point is, is that there is no stationary place for any individual who wants to succeed. Hear this. There is no permanent building for a success driven man. Write it down. No permanent building for a success driven man. Why? Even when he has attained his strive for mastery. That is the driving force. That make people move from one level of greatness to another level of greatness. That is to say, in January, your senior brother can be the richest when whole paper pass. But in March, go day number 10. Because some people are determined to live where they have been to where they should be. Write it down. Because some people are determined 
to live where they have been to where they should be. Hear this. Hear this. Hear this. You can't be bigger than your brain. You cannot be bigger in achievement, in success than the capacity of your brain. Now, but you can be lesser than your brain. Mm. That is the reason why so many sized of an adult brain still behave like children's brain. Lesser functionality, but not a greater functionality. When a man's thinking has been empowered, his life radiated. But when a man's thinking is under maximized, he can be 40 years old that talk like a 10 years old boy. Write it down. That is why it doesn't matter your age. What should drive you should be your accomplishment in life. Your accomplishment in life. Your pursuit. Now here this. Everyone can have what is chasing. But not everything is worthy of our chasing. Write it down. Everyone can be chasing anything. But not everything is worthy of your chase. For example. So many who are lazy have left the pistol of a mortar to chase the fowl that came visiting. Now, what is the problem with the fowl that picked the crumb from your mortar? Your problem is laziness. And so you chase after the fowl. Are, are, you, are you following me? That is why great people, great people don't pay attention to frivolities. Write it down. Write it down. Great people, they don't. They don't pay attention. If you like, make a video of them. Ridicule them. They will not answer you because they are chasing something much more important than what you are doing. And can I say this? Write it down. If you, hear, if you have ears that hear your enemies, you are far from success. If you have ears that hear your enemies, you are far from success. Can I shock you? Those who walk the pageant, for beauty contest. They don't listen to side talk. Otherwise they will miss their step. It takes a determination to shine your shine. And you must do it that void of people's opinion. But be mind conscious of what God has said about you. There is a vision ahead of you. That should not be confused with what people think about you. It's their personal opinion. It has nothing to do with divine mandate. Can I shock you? That you know how to cook. Do not mean that you are a cook. But I may want you to be a cook for my selfish reasons and interest. Why your divine purpose is abuse. When a thing is not known, abuse is inevitable. Write it down. And that is why when you don't know a child, you abuse the children. You give them train of Bokpov to go and sell on the street. Because you, are, you don't know anything about their destiny. And so also you that is seated in this church. That 2021 finished. And we have entered 2022. Nothing changes in your life if you did not change. Write it down. Nothing changes in your life. If you that is in the church have not changed. Can I shock you? Every prayer of your pastor need a place of expression. Write it down. Every prayer of your pastor needs a place of expression. And if God must do a thing, there must be a man. If God must do a thing, there must be a man. Are you not surprised that you will not carry twins until you find a wife? Even though it's in your destiny by God. And even though a pastor lay hand on you, you need a wife. Do you know those of you that don't want to marry because you have a girlfriend? Do you know you are a cheat to your destiny? Oh my good God. You will sell your son because your sperm is, deposit, is constantly deposited in a well without a bottom. And now your, now your twins, they go so. Your twins, they go so. You say, oh, but if you see as I have my last night, hey, now, now your twins, you waste. President, pastors like me, now you pour out like that for free. Miami. <laughs> Women are too expensive. 
very, very. And that is where poor people should not embark on, embark on having a woman. No, because they are expensive. And if you bring a woman into your life and you don't have the means to maintain the woman, you have brought your problem to yourself. No woman is actually bad. Now the man will not when carry him, not sabi. May I continue? I should continue today. Now Papa talk and they talk. Oh. Not be preaching today. Oh. I'm just talking to somebody who has come to 2022. And it's expected that because I prayed yesterday, because I prayed day before yesterday, amen, 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 and you will sleep, and you expect something to happen. It will not happen. It will not happen until you are ready for something to happen. Are you hearing me? You, so I said, women, they are what? Expensive. That is the reason why what it takes to friend a girl for six years is enough to marry a wife for 12 years. What your cheat? You deceive yourself when you think that you were dating her to know her. Go and ask your mother whether your father know her till she die. Who do you know? Marry a woman, deal with whatever comes out with it. Tell me that you know your sister. Your own sister, your blood. You know, I am testing. Anytime you think you are testing, two things is going. Your chromosomes and your money. And sometimes you have jack away. May I use word? Maybe some children not go to hear me. You have jack away prominence. And now you are depositing irrelevance. Write it down. You jack away. <laughs> Prominent governor, president, pastor, bishop. Now you they jack away. Jack them away and leave up rubber for his head. <laughs> and you are wondering. How the Bible says when Jacob, when Jacob saw Reuben in Genesis chapter number four, this is Jacob said to Reuben, he said, Reuben, you are my strength, my first push. Go and ask that man that is looking for a wife, where's your first push? You are the cream of me as a man. That is the first time I push something out. Now you be the product. Wait to be your first push. Sunday toilet. Sunday your washing basin. Sunday, some day, some. Am I talking here? So, if you want to shine your shine, find a house. Yes. If you must shine, stop squatting. Say, cause. <laughs> no man is ever responsible when he keeps sharing responsibility. We follow Parrot, we follow Paul Lightby, we follow Pay Gatsby, we follow Pay everything. No wonder, by the time you now finally get a house, life looks strange to you, even though you've been in Europe for many years. Because all your life now, share, share, you share. We are one, two, three, four, five. We share the light bill. How much? 180, or you share that into five. Okay. The other say, no, we be four. Your wife come. Your wife, your wife, not the use of time. Your wife, not the. <laughs> Look at a man. No wonder that the time you will be alone, your wife will tell you food as well. Say, how many of us there is that? No, but let me go there, do this thing. Now you are who go do up. Talk to me, sir. A man, I tell the wife, way. I pay the rent, you pay the last bill. Somebody say, shame to that man. You ask your wife to share responsibility. He said, if I'm paying the school fees, eh, you'll be buying the food. After all, I am paying the school fees. Who told you that the woman has a responsibility other than to use what you give her? You want to shine? Get a house. You want to shine? Get a residence. Somebody know they hear me. You see that six months they get to you and you start traveling. That makes you a fool. That makes you what? A fool. Your first document is not to pay any person visit. It's to have a residence. If you are wise enough, understand that no document ever stands until there's a resident behind the document. 
do everything to have a residence, not hospitality. Do you want to say, may I talk? I'm not preaching. I am talking as a father. Are you hearing me? Get a house. Get a residence. Now hear this. Number three, if you want to sign, avoid trouble. For every fingerprint will be your finger trouble. Every fingerprint that is collected from you has a day where they will stand up against you. Avoid it. It doesn't matter how small the case is, how big the case is. Somebody say, you don't know. Tell the person you are right. Carry this wahala. Go somewhere else. I have an assignment in Europe and it's not part of spoiling my name and my dirty my fingerprint. Can't allow you to drag me in. Then I hear this. Hear this. Once you've gotten your name free from trouble, be established. Can I shock you? The greatest fall of those who will not succeed, even though they plan to succeed, is that they don't have establishment. They remain as hustler. There's nothing wrong in hustling. Your first income is not to impress people. It should be about getting yourself established. For a tree planted today is a fruit harvested tomorrow. Write it down. Not starting early is a cause. What did I say? Not starting early is a cause. If you have option of having a work and a family, prefer a family. For what you sow early, you will have early reaping. Early reaping. Neither they call early corn. Shall we not eat them? You'll be surprised that somewhere in February you see corn. corn. And you'll be surprised. Ha, 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 corn. Somebody planted early. And that's why it's harvesting this early. This early. Establishment is so important that people miss it. They gather money. They think that because they are rich, they are established. No. Wealth is not establishment. Money is not establishment. Until you have source of wealth, you are not established. So pursue it. If you must shine, you can only shine when you have somewhere that generates fun for you. Number, I don't know. Write it down. As soon as you are established, duplicate your establishment. Hear this. The first sweat that comes to you is personalized. It runs from your blood. The, the second dimension of word is a stream from your stream. A stream from your stream. Do you know when money starts working for you? Then you know you are standing. The first time you walk for money. A time comes where you put money on the ground and money works for you. There are people as we are talking now, they are inside this church sitting down and money is working for them. They can sleep for one year and after one year, money will pay them what money has worked. Therefore, the first money is not your consumption. It's to multiply your establishment. Am I talking to somebody here? And the reason is, the reason why struggle lasts even in your 40s is because you didn't start early in your 20s. Now hear this. At 40, you should not be looking for establishment. No. You should have been in the process of multiplying your stream of income. But at 40, you find out that so many have not started anything. They are looking for Mr. Right, and Master Right, or Miss Right, and all of that. All of that. If you have a girlfriend here, Marry her next week. It's the best advice I'm giving to you. Stop feeding her if you have not paid her bread price. Send her to go and feed herself because she's cheating on your future. If she eats your food, stay under your roof and marry another person. Oh, what a waste. Truth talk, sir. Say that again. Say it again. Amplify it. Hey, Away a sorrow. Is it not shocking to you that your 15,000 euro is with a lady that is not comfortably another man's wife? 
And your wife that you now marry, you are telling I used to have money. What a fool. If you see what we use money to do for this country, I was not the one. Now hear this. Women, listen to this one. Any man who wants to talk to you and is telling you something about the S and is showing you something good about the S, run away from him. It's not a good person. What did I say? I don't like the way you talk to me. My ex never talked to me like this. Run away. Don't marry him. It's a man who is trying to go to the future but tie himself to the back. He's going nowhere. If that ex treats you better, why did you leave her? You must be a fool then. You must be a fool. To be telling your wife how good your ex is. You are the biggest mistake of a husband. I'm sorry I'm not preaching. So don't say pastor preach. I just the uh, talk. You, you couldn't have lived her to come and be telling me if you see what they do for me. How can you see foam? You call the lie on other ground. Does it make sense? It doesn't make sense. Praise the Lord. Add this to it. If you will prosper, stop causing the head of your stream. Mommy, did you hear what I said? Let me explain. Those who will first clean water don't go to trouble the head of the stream. For he who trouble the head of the stream have dirty water to first home. There are people that are head of your stream. Your parents. Therefore, if you have lifted your hand to push your father or your mother or even hit them after the service, call them and say, your pastor says you should apologize and they must bless you before they die. Because your head of stream has been troubled. Now hear this. If you have ever insulted a pastor, a man of God, after this service, go and call that man of God and apologize. Your future has been troubled. It's not a man of God. Real man of God. There they are. There they are. They cheat yourself. Because there is something about the law that governs the earth. That what goes around have a world coming around. Don't do everything you want to do. Now write this one down. Look, I, I want you to help me tell the person by side. Talk to the person. Say, neighbor, you may know what you are doing, but you can't certainly know what is doing you. If you say you know, I want you to tell me the meeting they call your name in the last three days. Do you know? Therefore, tell the person by side and write it down. Don't trust yourself if you have not proven what is driving you. Yes. The very day you just wake up, you feel like sleeping with somebody's wife. Don't sleep first. First find that why your wife did and another person wife, they hungry you. There's something pushing you. Find out what they push you first before you do it. A lot of us do finish, then we can't ask ourselves, why do this thing? Instead of asking why I do this thing, why not ask why I won't do this thing? Why I won't do one? Just wake up one morning and you feel like throwing your husband away. You feel like calling, scattering your home. Ask yourself, why I won't do one? Not be when you don't finish, huh? then you're going to say, I don't know what I do. Who will that one help? And lastly, for today, lastly for today, amen, don't miss service. It's not a help for pastor. It's a cheat on your destiny. You know, we always think that going to church have a way of helping pastor. And so when, that is why we always cut ourselves out. And after some time, we feel like, let's go and help him again. Pastor, eh, I'll be busy. It has nothing to do with me. Now, hear this. Pastors are driven for success, sometimes growth, and then they push you to like, why you not come, why you not come? And you take that as a yastic that they need your presence. 
A service is a place of application. Now, there will be so many applications in this January. I hope you are aware. In this country, there's so much to apply for now. So much. Throughout this year, there will be so much to gain. Now, now when they will begin to apply, travel. Travel. And I mean, travel. Just keep traveling. In Proverbs chapter number six, he said, He that traveleth, so shall your poverty come. He that fold, he said, A little sleep, a little slumber, a little folding of her. Shall your poverty come like a man that traveleth? So, traveling, when it's not on business purpose, is a shortage to your destiny. You just see that carry bag and they go, my friends. It is one week, your friends has one week of idleness, one week of expenses without income. Well, I travel. Travel. Is it holiday? No. You not get work. It really they show. And that's why you are stamping your passport. Every day. They stamp and they come on. They stamp and they enter. Are you not surprised that when you want to renew your document, they ask you to photocopy every page of your passport? Just to monitor you. Because many times, we are so stupid that we have a working contract and our passport has so many stamp out and stamp in. Who employed you that you are traveling like this? What a lie. And then you are waiting. I don't know why my paper never come out. Pastor, hold my hand. Now so pastor went, no, no. Pastor went, mumu. Go follow you. Join. That is why God tell pastor, ask questions. Ask questions before you delay her. May you not partake of people's problems. Give me your hand. Any power that hold your document, I'm shaking, you are shaking, be shaking together. Any power that hold your document, anywhere they are, loose, loose, loose. Now me and you go faint. <laughs> Paper will be tied until the reason for tying is discovered. Am I talking to somebody? So when they said they are going to apply for something, brother, be there. Don't take this for granted. Ah, they have started applying for this thing. No, there are people that we hold the document. They have all it takes. And I'll go next week. Then eventually next week they get there. And when they get to the calf, they get to where they will apply. There are too many people. Oh boy, I don't feel wait. I'll come back again. Then next three, next three weeks, they now hear the thing has been true. I mean, God, they say don't feel this God, they're wicked, sir. Una wicked, sir. Una here, una not a person. Are you sure you did not hear? Where are you that you don't hear the announcement? Where are you? You take this for granted. And so life is cheating on you. When the master that you not hear that one. Oh, you not hear that one. And deck a kayo. Oh, yeah, do it. Oh, yeah, do it. Oh, yeah, do it. Oh, Oh my good God. Are you still there? Today is fun, right? I'm not preaching. I just they talk. Now talk and they talk. When you come next week, we are going to preach. Praise the Lord. That you, I said, when people rush for a thing, they used to say that when people rush for beer and it did not read their hand, they say, wait a minute, that they beat her. But you were pursuing it too. So when you hear people miss opportunity, they say, after all, no, 800, wait till that one. Maybe I get money. If they add 800, Joe, wait till you get, you know the increase. 800, one, two, three, four times 800. Is that not 2,000 plus? You know, they, they know they add that joint, wait till you get. They know they add them. Then they give, ask question, prepare yourself. Prepare yourself. We, let me shock you. Can I go deeper? Because of that statement when you talk now. Can I go deeper? All right, let me go deeper. How many times have you gone to read the Constitution of Italy? To find the Constitution of Italy, to find out how much should be declared in my reality if we are three in the house, four in the house, five in the house. We don't know. But do you know, funny enough, our church charge and bear representative, I don't want to call names. 
Let me, let me, oh God. Pastor, can I talk more? Are you aware that if you apply, for example, those of you that come in and enter the camp, that each one of you generate for the government lawyer 8,800? Are you aware? Okay. Now, do you know that it's a business to make you fail the first commission? To send you back to that court again for another 1,008? Who wants to give you that paper? Are you aware? So you needed to know that you are a good business every time you come out with negative. You are making somebody rich. But if you do not know, you don't know. They play on our intelligence because there is something we are doing. What are we doing? We have refused to integrate. As somebody learn the language. Nonsense. This useless language. Move with people. No, 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 no. At the end of the day, when they now say they need a paper, you are not running up and down looking for who will write contract. If you have had a friend, a reliable friend among these people before now, you would have been surprised that in the days of need, one of your friends can stand up and butter your bread. But no, you won't greet any person. You can't even visit any person. You get any of your boyfriend when you enter a house. Get one when they enter your house. No, all your friends now, people will follow road come. There's people that need help. You are not planning well. You are not planning well. There's nothing wrong in making me your friend. But I still a hustle. There's limit to what I can give you. There is what is called a motor. A motor. Somebody who, who. I, I tried many times to bring my wife. I will tell you that. I did many things. To have my wife come. Everywhere I applied, they keep eating my money and nothing was done. I was working. And I just told the white man I was working for. My wife is in Nigeria. I want her to come. I, is that the reason why your face is like this? I said, yes. So if my wife comes now, she's cooking for me. I'll be fine. Say you'll be fine. But how do you even stay without your wife here? I said, no problem. Oh. You feel stay. He said, no, I can't stay. I will help you. I will help you. I will call my daughter who is married to a lawyer. He go tell me how I go feel help you. And he, he made the call. The next day he said, and I'm on prefectura. We went to prefectura. He helped me feed everything. Not only we collected the form. He helped me feed the form and put point where point is supposed to be. And write it the way it's supposed to be written. And say submit. And the visa came out and my wife is here. But I have struggled by myself. And today, there's somebody just on top of you, but you know they greet them. You meet somebody in the step, and so you walk up as I like, say, no be human being. Ordinary bojodo, you don't know how to say. Come and style. You don't know. Even this Christmas, Happy Christmas. You know even wish those people went there the same house with you. And tomorrow you will say, God will help me. They are human beings God has planted around you to help you. Some of them will help your children. Some of them will help your wife. Some of them will help your husband. Some of you have got a job. It was somebody who helped you. Some of you have sojourned today. Somebody who helped you. A Nigerian man can't come here and help you with some things here. You need these people when you get this land. Anywhere the soul of your fish are tread upon, that land have I given to you. Start learning how to have friends here. Start learning how to speak their language. Start learning how to eat their food. That's another problem. Our friendship can't last because we can't eat what they eat. That's so why they call you, come out. Ordinary cafe, they buy, give you. You just can't eat the cafe. He said, baby, boom. No, 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 no. That was the last time they called you. It's done. You close a road. That road could lead you. Can I shock you as I ran off? A, a, a boy always was selling in where they feel bumbler. I'm talking about 20 years ago. In Melito. They sell bumbler there. And then there's this customer that always come. He will help them to carry it. He treat them nice and talk with them. They chat. They play. 
was very nice to this family. So they keep coming because of him. They always like to buy. One day, the place got caught fire and burned this boy. So they came to buy gas again and they did not see him. They asked the boss. He said he did not come because look at the accident. Wow, what happened? They explained. He didn't know how to look for him. They rested. That man keep coming to that shop to see whether that boy will resume. After two months, he came back and met the boy. And when he met him and the boy is there, he said, you are still here to work after what the experience? He said, because I don't have anything. Okay, do you know how to do business? Say yes. Can you do business? Say yes. If you, I give you money to do business, can you do business? Yes. He gave you the equivalent of 50,000 euro in today's currency. That was in Lira. I gave him that money and then this boy took the money and he said, make sure you go and do the business. The boy went and do business and told him, in three years time, come to this same place, so-so date and so-so time and bring back the money. Whatever profit you make out of this money is your own. The boy said, okay. He went and invested the money and started doing well. Three years, he came back to that spot. Trust. There are so many of us that will say, bye-bye. Don't hammer. Maga four. Uh, uh, mugu four. Maga chop. You get sense. At the end of the day, now you go be the mugu. And so the boy came back three years and brought the money. And said to the man, the man came and the boy came. I brought the money. You brought the money, yes. Have you made money? He said, I even have this money doubled. You doubled it? Yes. Wow. The man looked at him and said, well, I did not plan to collect this money from you. But I don't want to tell you that it's free so you will not be lazy. The money belongs to you. Now, come. I bring another one. Take this 25,000 euro, equivalent of 25,000. Add it to the first 50,000. All is yours. And the boy said to him, now listen, it is that person you are greeting. Both John, come and start. We start the One day, may be a God sent to you. Rise on your feet. Tell the Lord, teach me to treat people right. Teach me to do the right things. For it's my time to shine. I'm not ready for mistakes anymore. I'm not ready to repeat my wrongs. No, 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 no. I want my life fixed once and for all. Open your mouth. Open your mouth. Share it to the Lord. In prayer. In prayer, I want to hear you pray. Wherever you are, I want to hear you pray. I want to hear you pray. Open your mouth. Can I hear you pray? Teach me Speak. how to teach, treat people right. Teach me to treat I don't people want to right. Make mistakes of 2020. Teach me to do right. Not God in this year, 2020. No more mistakes. I don't want to be repeating teach me my wrongs. I don't want to waste my teach life. Me to teach, teach me how to do things. I don't want to miss service and miss my opportunity of receiving from the Lord. I want to be there. I don't lack wisdom. I want to be there. I don't lack wisdom. I need 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 wisdom. To live right Teach me to do it at the right time, time with people around me. Let me not procrastinate. To do things right. That's the end of this moment. I rebuke it in the name of Jesus. To serve you more. Teach me to serve you better. Everything that I need to do in Jesus' name. Amen. Do me a favor. Pray for yourself. I will do well this year. Just go ahead. Pray for yourself. Pray for yourself. Pray for yourself. Pray for yourself. Say something about your life. I will do well. This year, 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 I will do well. Amen. Let me hold a number. Let me hold a number. Are you holding a number? Yes, sir. Look at the number. Say, God bless you. God bless, God bless you. you. Tell the neighbor, please, this year. Please, this year. I'm begging you. I'm begging you. Don't walk in. Tell the person, don't walk in. I don't know. Don't, don't walk in. in I don't know. know. Walk in. I know. Walk, walk in. I know. know. Hold that hand. Hold that hand. I don't know. Now I take Goji. 
I don't know. So. No, 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 you don't go. Nami go. Let people take goji. No, no, be people. Stop them. I know they like this kind of thing. Which one be people? Now people go. Let me go. I am now. Uh, when I na uh, when uh, uh, Santa Maria phobia. As soon as I entered that that Santa Maria road, I was coming to your house. As soon as I just entered that road, I was I say, hey, wait till now do me here. Wait till now, I not go feel forget them. I was coming back as soon as I read them, my body changed. My wife said, what did they do? I said, this place. If you know what did they do me here? If you know what did they do me here? Me, I was a man of God holding my Bible. Remove your clothes. Toy, 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 toy. Come, come, come. I was every man of God, oh. They don't know that I'm a man of God. Because I don't know. It's not an excuse. When you are being destroyed, when you are being punished. What is my crime? I don't know. I thought in Africa, you don't carry something. You put fire, you don't get born. You don't get born. I keep pressing. I born. That's, that's the end. Oh my God. This I don't know. Let me make you the cry hard I know. You had opportunity of seeing two wonderful ladies. The one will go favor you, you drop her. Now the one will go kill you, now you can't pick. And you are not shouting, how do I know? Mm. You come more for better church. You not go to church where they go naked you, they buff you. And you are not shouting, how do I know? Wait till how do I know? Who he help? Nobody. Lord, in this year, Lord, Lord, I will walk in I know. I will walk, walk in I know. The word of God say, my people perish for lack of knowledge. I must know. Open your mouth and pray that prayer. What that person? No, no, they pray for nonsense. In this year, I will walk in I know. I will walk in knowledge, not in ignorance. Ah, I will walk in knowledge. May I not be a victim of ignorance. Kalemo Sayada. I don't want the pain. I said, I don't know. 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 Amen. God will bless this year for you. Amen. God will prosper this year for you. Amen. And yet you will be the best in all set of life. Amen. Thank you, Heavenly Father, Thank for your In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. And quickly we are going to